quivering ration to the ecstasy. Oh, she's brilliant. But your 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 spin on this I love where the piano wire type tension of the neck. Currency. Years. So good. You think? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Emily Dickinson's got nothing. Okay, no, no. You need to read more Dickinson. <laughs> what is it? Something. This is the thing of feathers. Something? Eric, you're missing the most important word. Partial <laughs> <laughs> oh. credit. Alright, so. One small moment of joy brings the pain. One ecstatic instant, they must have been out of this Call you later. <laughs> Why does Dickinson write the word dwell in possibility? The word dwell bothers me. Hi. Hi. Um, I always view dwell a little negatively. Possibility is there, but she doesn't leave her house, you know? It's not a coffee cup quote. That makes total sense. Tea? No, I'm okay. Are you sure you don't want mm -hmm. some jasmine mint tea? Holy shit, mom, holy shit! No, I knew it, I knew it when you told me he was taking you to that ridiculous restaurant. Yep, he did it, and well, I went with yes. I love this ring. It was his grandmother's. Mom, I'm so happy for you. I'm so happy for both you and Tim. Me too. Wow, yeah, wow! <laughs> Did I overhear you talking to a boy? I was in the hallway. Yeah. College boy? Anna? No, it's nothing. He lives 900 miles away. It's nothing. Doesn't sound like nothing. Tim get down on one knee and all that. Nice try. And yes, he did. It's nothing. It's just this guy that I talk to online. Uh, I think those are literally famous last words. Wow, so salty now that she's engaged. <sighs> I'm gonna get a coffee, do you want one? Brit. I railed Mr. Golding in the chem lab. He told his wife, and now we're in a polyamorous threesome. It's great. Brit! Hi, sorry, what? Do you want a coffee? Uh, yeah. Please, thank you. You don't have to yell at me. Eric, don't answer that. Hi, Eric, who are you? Oh, uh, hi. Hi, who are you? Hey, uh, I'll call you later, okay? You can't do that. Who's Eric? Not okay, Brit. You'll call him later? That sounded like a man. What does that mean? Who is that? He's a little older. Okay, how much older? I don't know, college. We just talk. You're a naughty little girl, aren't you? Stop! Honey? Coming! An old soul, having lived through love and loss in past iterations, sees the whole picture and is often described as wise beyond their years. See, that, that's definitely you. FaceTime?
You don't want to see me? Sometimes I like to just focus on your voice and your words about that distracting face of yours. Yeah, all right. <laughs> this instead we we actually see each other <laughs> yeah sure just swing on by why don't you don't you think we should meet someday no no <laughs> <laughs> it's part of the charm of this relationship Eric the vast distance that separates us houses tomorrow and then Tim and I are going to meet with the caterers for the engagement party but hi oh, cool. um, I wanted to get back in time to maybe do like a little birthday thingy with you before you and the girls head out okay Hey. Hey. I'm starting to think you were ghosting me. No, no, I got um, got a little lost. What do you mean? I don't know where I am. Let me. Uh, I'll turn the camera. Up. I'll show you. <laughs> Pretty sure I can't help you. But okay. and aggressive this is? Yeah. Oh, I'm sorry. I, 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 I guess I thought it was some big gesture. Yes, big dumb gesture. Yeah. Um, I 
have no interest in, in coming in. I just I wanted to give you that. Happy birthday. <laughs> <laughs> um, no, you know what? Actually, I um, one more thing, and then and then I'll go. You are even prettier in person. Oh, and, um, I'm gonna go now. <laughs> um, I'm sorry if I freaked you out, idiot. It's really dumb. Um. Call me later if you if you like it. I met you like half an hour okay, ago. Okay, fine. Well, we... When we first, you know, got to know each other, I knew how special you were, and, and I... I panicked. You mean you lied? Yeah. Why did you panic? Incredibly smart, and you're f funny, you're kind, and you're caring. You're like a million and one other things. And I just, I knew I didn't want to lose something with so much potential. Hey, could you be there at 4:30 today? I need help with the ribbons. Ribbons? Yeah, it's a thing we do. It's ironic. Is it now? Yeah, 75%. Ironic? <laughs> well, congrats on your big, dumb gesture. Well, you know, go big and dumb and go home, right? Thank you for the book. It was one of the most thoughtful gifts anyone's ever given me. Go ahead. <laughs> um, okay. No. <laughs> no, there's no way I'm not getting a hug. <laughs> Babe. 
It's an ironic hat, and you have to wear it. It's a rule. Where's the birthday girl at? I don't know, and the girl should be here any minute to pick her up. Anna! You said, come in. Um, I have something for you downstairs, and the girls are almost here, so. Yeah, no, I'm, I'm sorry I snapped. I'm sorry I barged in. No, I fell asleep. I'm just grumpy. No big deal. I'll be out soon. Okay. Oh. That's I don't know how I'm going to get you out of here. Wait, wait. My mom and Tim are home. Uh, uh, the window. It doesn't open wide enough for a body. I've tried. <laughs> no, I can't stay here. You have to. No, I can't. Okay, then let's go out there and have Tim arrest you. Tim's a cop. Assistant chief of police. <sighs> Is my head still intact? Yeah, I think so. Because she nearly bit it off. <laughs> Birthday girl! I won't be out late. No, I, I can't. I can't stay in your house. I'll make it as quick as I can. I promise. Anna! Coming! Please, just stay here. I'll be back soon, okay? I want to see you later. You promise? Apparently, it's tradition. <laughs> okay, well, we should. Yeah, we have to go. Uh, wait. Uh, no, no, no. Okay, I baked this vegan cake from scratch. I know you don't like sweets, but you have to at least try it. Okay, one bite, and then we'll go. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Do you like it? Mm -hmm. Bye. Okay, let's go. We should. We'd let's go. Bye. Thank she you. Was good. She liked it. One That's bite. Good. She liked it. Hey. Oh my god. Danny. Yeah, so happy birthday, I guess. Um, Britt, who apparently is a liar, told me you wouldn't be here, so. Um, uh, thank you, Danny. Yeah, um, okay. All right, uh, bye. I'll see you, I'll see you later. <laughs> Bye, Denny. Stop. 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 That was so sweet. You know, it's funny, right? You sold it to me and now I'm trying to sell it back. Yeah, well, I know where all the asbestos is hidden. <laughs> I just hesitate to leave this place. You know, 
after Gary left, we floated around to some shitty situations. And this is the first place that's felt like home. I get it. I do. Join your birthday party? Sorry, um, it's just it's just my mom checking in on us. Oh, yeah. Tim and her are like my relationship goals. Yeah. Love you. You too. You too. What kind of shit is that? What do you mean? You too? I love you. That's what I thought. Mm -hmm. sailed a long time ago. Your dad ever call you on your birthday? Uh, no. I haven't spoken to him since I was four, but I'm not interested. It's pretty much the only time my dad calls me. that zucchini muffin you like. Mm. Uh, so are you gonna be in trouble with me for something? What do you mean? I mean, I'm thinking maybe you got up to something yesterday. What does that mean? Did you guys smoke pot or something? Did we, no. Why? Well, because you hate cake and there's that. That wasn't me. No. That was Britt. She was begging me for more cake. I hope you don't mind. Of course not. Did she like it? 
You got Brit to eat vegan. Yeah, I did. Yeah, you did. Um, I'm just doing laundry. Do you need anything? Uh, no, I'll do mine later. Okay, and you girls are gonna go out later? Mm hmm. Okay, have fun, be careful. Uh, I don't know, bad stuff and people and drugs and any and all bad things that you may encounter. Right. Okay. Bye, baby. Bye. You hung out. <laughs> you can't stop smiling. I never met anyone like him. Anna. He just gets me. Okay, you should be careful. You don't really know this guy. I think I do. Plus, he's kind of old. He's not that old. So is this gonna be like a whole thing? Hey. No, or me? Hey, you guys coming or what? Yeah! Uh, I'll catch up. Send no nudes, dude. Sextortion, it's real. My mom made me watch a whole TED talk about it. It's crazy. Yeah, okay. Okay? Jesus Christ, where are you? Um, I don't know. Sad truck stop somewhere. I've been calling you since last night. Oh, my God, sorry. You're going home? Yeah. I came home and you weren't there. Um, yeah, and it was weird as shit being there with my mom. No, I know, but Anna, it was too weird. Like, I heard her get in the shower and I, I got out of there. You ate a piece of cake. Oh, on your birthday. <laughs> you left the plate out and my mom found it? I'm so sorry. <laughs> it's, it's not funny. I mean, it's funny, but it's not. I'm sorry. Yeah, you know, you should be sorry, you psycho. <laughs> Yeah, it's one of them. Okay, so the ceremony would be here, and then they have the pole barn as a weather backup. And you, you can have the fire pit outside and the band and out there. Awesome. Yeah. I think this is the one. Cool? Yeah. Do you want to see the other one? Uh, I think it's fair to say this is only interesting to us.
at you, Mama. <laughs> it's cute, right? It's very cute. You know what? Hmm. Tim is lucky to have you. What brings on that random act of kindness? I don't know. I'm just... I'm just glad to see you happy. Thanks, baby. I am glad to be happy. I just always thought there was a part of you that didn't want to let yourself be happy, that's all. Maybe. But if something makes you happy, you should honor that, right? I think so, yes. Ugh. <laughs> No worries. Does it look okay? Yeah. Boyfriend. Oh, uh, wow. Okay. Yeah, big news, I know. That's cool. Yeah. You didn't say anything. <laughs> I am now. Denny? Nope. Do I know him? He doesn't go to my school. How do you know him? Oh, this is going to sound worse than it is, but we met online. You met on the internet? <laughs> yeah. How old is this guy? He's older. How old? Um, 20s? Mid 20s? Mid 20s? I think so, yeah. You can't do that, Anna. You can't do that. I'm too late. I know, I know. I need a better tack. I know I shouldn't have told you. No. I'm glad you did. I am. I, I just... What? I'm worried about you, Anna. I'm worried you might be in over your head. I'm not in over my head. How do you know? I'm in love. Anna. What? I don't want to keep anything from you anymore. Good. I don't want you to. This has been really stressing me out. <sighs> oh, I'm sure. And we can figure this out. There's nothing to figure out. Uh, where, where does he live? Really far away. Like 900 miles. So you guys have never seen each other? No, we have. Did you, are you having sex? He comes here. He drives 900 miles to see you. Where is he? Where is he now? He's here, actually. He's outside. He's here? Yeah. He wants to meet you. 
And I want you to meet him. <sighs> you sure about that? Okay. Okay. Nobody's dead yet. Still early. Yeah, this is, yeah, we're, we're taking all this in right now. Sure, I understand. It's a lot of new info. Yeah, 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 I'm sorry. Um, yeah, uh, look, let me, let me start out by saying I never intended for any of this to happen. We met online. On a poetry form. Yeah, we, we, it was, we were talking poetry. I mean, that's it. I, I didn't know anything about Anna. I mean, really, the truth is, we, we fell in love before we even knew it. Mom. Give yeah. me a second. Yeah, yeah, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. No. Sorry about. Hey. We can handle this. It's a crush. Haley did something similar. I want him out. What? He needs to be out of my house. You know, I think if you make it off limits to Anna, she's just gonna. my house. No, mom. Get no. out now. Okay. No, out. it's not okay. No, if he goes, I go. No. Yes, I go with him. Eric, can I talk to you alone for a minute? No. Yeah. It is Eric, right? No, no. Hey, it's okay. No, it's, it's not okay. okay. Beautiful. What? I mean, I... Hey, come on. Give a second. Oh. What's this sequence? I don't know. What, what am I? What am I doing? What am I doing? What's going on? Uh, nothing. I, I just have to go. What did she say to she you? She didn't say. I just have to go. What did you say? Nothing. To you? Hey, she didn't say anything. Okay? There's just nothing to be done right now. We're just stuck. That's it. I don't want you to go. Everybody needs a little break. I'll come with you. No, Anna. No, I'm trying to send the way to do it. I know that this is hard for you. I'm sorry. But we felt like this was the right thing to do. Getting it out in the open.
What did you say to him? You you stay out of it. will pass. She has a crush. They had sex. When? I don't know. Her birthday or just after he waited until she was 17. He knew what he was doing. He knew exactly what he was doing. It's a hell of a lot of calculation. Yes, it is. And what if that's not the case? It is the case. How do you know? Because I know, Tim. Okay. I never want to see that man again. Hey. We got this, okay? We got this together. I know it seems like a big deal right now, but we got this. big group hug when they met or what? No, but I didn't think she'd go as crazy as she did. Surprise the shit out of me. What are you gonna do? I don't know. Eric won't call me back. But yeah, maybe his future father-in-law cop freaks him out a little bit. No, trust me, my mom was way more terrifying. Look, maybe it's for the best, you know? No, it's not, Brett. Don't say that. Okay. She's not gonna win this one. Okay. I think we look good in that. Mm-hmm. I mean, it's it's stunning. Thank you. And if you decide you want to make an offer, just give me a call or. Okay. Thank you so Thank much. Thank you. Bye bye. Bye guys. Sorry, I uh, thought you were at the door. You can't be here. Well, I mean, sign out front says open house. It's weird to see you do something other than teaching. I'll see you in a little bit. What? <laughs> Those are the last words that you ever said to me. I don't remember. I do. I guess I just didn't realize that a little bit could mean 12 years. We couldn't talk. Why? What was stopping us? Well, your parents, my husband, attorneys, Everyone. Yeah, but what they said didn't matter. What you said did. And then I'll see you in a little bit and, and, what, nothing. For 
12 years until I seek you out. Via my daughter. Well, I mean, that just happened. Oh, you just happened to seek me out on the internet and run into her and somehow just end up, whoops, falling in love with my child. She's an amazing person. But I'm sure you already know that. Whatever you think you have with Anna, it's over. So you're gonna ruin that too? She's 16. She's 17. And that's your argument? That she's too young? This is different. Why? Because she's a girl? No. The difference is, and this is a huge difference, is nothing ever happened between you and me. <laughs> what do you... What do you mean? This isn't good. What do you mean nothing happened? Something happened. Just not what you think, not what you told the school. How can you even say that? Because it's the truth. I know this might be hard for you to hear, but it's important that you hear it. We were close. Too close. That's on me. I was the adult, and I should have known better, but... But what? This thing happens. Happens sometimes, Jesse. want things to be a certain way, and so they begin to believe that it's true. Hold on. Particularly when you're young, and there's nothing wrong with that. You know, I think that goes both ways, too. What do you mean? That some people don't want to remember something, so they block it out. I hear about that, too. It doesn't mean there's something wrong with you. Jesse. Beth. I had always hoped that you found some help. And I'm sorry that no one ever stepped in to help you. You need to go home. I don't have a home. Well, I do. And I don't ever want to see you near it again. Move away from the door. It's perfect. Do you want to tell him everything, or should I? I mean this in the most caring way possible. You need to speak with someone. Yeah. You. Everything okay? Can you please just move your car? Okay. Yeah. Hey, Beth. When you see Anna, tell her that nothing happened, okay? That there is no love between us, that it's just her overly active imagination, that it's just some sort of psychotic wish fulfillment at work. Can you tell her that for me? Please, get some help. You want to help me? Tell the truth. What truth? That you were in love with me as much as I was in love with you. I want to hear you say it out loud. Say it! Okay. Let's think about this for a second. ways this could go. You want to know what they are? Sure. I can handcuff you, arrest you, trespassing, maybe resisting arrest, haul you off to jail, hand you off to my real good buddies down there. It's not my favorite way. It's inefficient for both you and me. You want to know the second way? I'm guessing you do, so here it is. Get in your truck. You go home. All the way home. And you never come back. How do I know this plays out? Because I have your plates. I have everything about you. I know you. I got you. So yeah, what do you think? Option two? Yep. Yeah, that's what I would do too. Smart. I get it. Person to abuse the power over me. I bet. 
Elizabeth? Hey, Eric. What do you think? You think this is over? This whole messed up thing that you're doing here? You think it's done? Yeah. Yeah, I do. Me too. embarrassed. Okay. And? I was embarrassed, so I didn't say anything. Well, maybe now is a pretty good time to start talking. His name is Jesse, first off. He was a student of mine at the academy. Okay. I never wanted to have to tell you this. Jesus, Beth, spit it out. There was a scandal. Or a near scandal. I was accused of having an inappropriate relationship with him. Yeah, a sexual relationship. I took him under my wing. Too much. He developed these feelings for me. Okay. And he ended up creating this fiction. But I bear some other responsibility too. He's right. It should have never been personal. We should have never gotten close. Mm. Okay. Okay. Prior arrests? Nothing. Looks like he lives in an apartment that his parents own. Not in school. I'm not even sure he has a job. Hmm. All right, let's keep an eye out for those tags, understood? Absolutely. Hey. We need to talk. What is there to say? I owe you a huge apology. There's things I haven't told you. A lot of things. So he knew who I was when we started talking online. I can only assume that he was looking for me, came across you, and decided to use you to get to me, I guess. I'm so sorry, honey. Why didn't you say anything? I saw him there and I froze. I panicked. And it immediately brought me back to that time when you were four years old and I let this kid get too close to me. You should have told me. Okay. 
I was embarrassed and just sick that I had brought this heartache on you, Anna. Mom, just please. Send a patrol car to your street. Keep an eye on you and Anna. Good. How's Anna? Distant. Yeah, she'll be all right. Yes, eventually. I do have a bit of other news. What? The caterers said they could do the poppy seed ham biscuits after all. You gotta get out of your head and do something dumb and fun. Remember how you hounded me after Jake pulled that shit that he pulled on me? <laughs> I'm here to hound you back. I just don't get it. Well, there's nothing to get, really. You just landed a psychopath. Or a psychopath landed me, which makes me an idiot. The last thing you are is an idiot. Let's just focus on the fact you just dodged a big fat bullet. pick up Brit a little before the party. Okay. Okay. I love you, Mom. I love you too. 
with you, baby? They're trying to get me to test the wine. Uh-oh. Come on, the caterers are already setting up. Hey, this is your last chance to bail. We'd only owe for the catering. Not a chance. Shit, I need you to zip me up. <laughs> I gotta go. The florist is here. Love you. You too. Anna? Is that you? Hey, can you come zip me up? Sure. Don't call your cop fiance. Please just give me a second. You cannot be here. And then I'll leave. They're expecting me any minute. Do you know why I'm here? You've put me through enough, Jesse. So no, I don't know. And I just can't care anymore. I think you will, though. I really do. First things first, I'm here for Anna. Well, you can forget that. Yeah? She's not here, and she will never go anywhere with you. No? She knows who you are, Jesse. She knows everything. Hmm. You're right about that. Maybe you should check her room. care a little now. What do you want from me? No one believe me. Not even my dad. My mom, I think she wanted to, but mostly I think she just wanted it to go away. The embarrassment to go away. For the school. And then you, the only person that I ever trusted, you, you turned on me too. I heard what you said about me. Troubled, delusional, I think were your words of choice. Jesse, no. And then our phone call. Do you remember? No. I'll see you in a little bit. I never heard another word from you again. Jesse, this is not something that we can settle now. I tried we to kill myself. Yeah. That happened. And I failed, obviously. Jesse. But damn, you call me a liar. We can't do this. Just the two of us. We need to talk to someone. Mm -mm. Just give me my no, no, phone. No, look, I don't need to talk to someone, Beth. I need to talk to you. But since I've been here, I... What, Jesse? Can I show you something?
please. This was that year. This was spring of that year. Yes. But your hair is... Your hair is short. Yeah, I cut it over the holidays and kept it short. Because I cannot be more perfectly sure that your hair was long that spring. I could not be more sure. I mean, I, rem I remember specific occasions. I remember your hair. I remember your, your face. <laughs> but here you are. You're in this. You're in this picture, and <sighs> it was short then. <sighs> Why are you feeling like messed up about all of this right now? I mean, what, did I just want it so bad? Did I want it so bad that I, that I made it up? You know, I mean, like... It happens, Jesse. Yeah, it's okay. It, and everything that I've done since, and falling for Anna now, I mean, Jesus Christ! Because if that's, if that's the case, Beth, then, 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 like... What? Then I'm a fucking idiot! Then I'm, like, delusional! I'm like what everybody says I am! I'm wrong! I'm a liar, like, all of these years, like, what, what is that? I ruined everything, I ruined everything, I ruined your life. I mean, I know how much you love teaching, and I ruined that, and I hate myself for doing that. Oh, my God. Ah! Ah! I don't understand. You're looking at this photo as proof of a truth. But all I see is a lie. We look happy. Carrie was abusive, cheating. Maybe not the feelings, but the acting on them. What do you mean? The sex, Jesse. What happened in the car? I made a mistake. I was a mistake. 
I wish I could take it all back. I wish. I wish I could undo it all. See, that's the messed up thing. I, I don't... I don't wish that at all. Do you think it's possible that maybe... What? Maybe you still have feelings, right? No. Not like that. Yeah, it doesn't. And what are you doing to her? I know it's just a word at this point, but I am so sorry. I'm sorry I had to record this conversation. It just happens to be one of those states with generous statute of limitations. This isn't about ruining your life. It's about fixing mine. And will this fix you? In a way, I think it will. You know, what I've... What I've always wanted is just... Just to be acknowledged. <laughs> and you deserve to be acknowledged. Thank you. Just... Just what? Please don't do this! Take that. Take me, take my words. But please just don't take her. He's not taking me anywhere. I'm going with him. There's a difference. Okay. I to pack light. Sorry. You should forgive her. I should forgive her? Yes. So that's what you told me this is all about? Not vengeance? Moving forward? So we can all move forward? I 
like you said. That is what we're doing, right? I'll go hit the car. Um, parked at the dead end. Apparently the cops drive down every 20 minutes. Okay. I know what you're thinking. You think I'm making a huge mistake, that I'm abandoning you, but... I don't think you are, no. Why not? Because I don't think he's coming back. You're wrong. Go in. Thank you. For what? For saving me back there. The only thing I saved you from is prison. Fix your hair. Yeah. 
It's your party. Smile. 